hello guys no, good evening um oh, welcome back to my channel um sorry all right today's uh video is um for mamas okay now thank you very much for joining in for tuning in for clicking on this video this is your girl the beauty misty um i do the skincare blah 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 mistress concussion <laughs> All right, so we on this channel we share recipes, and today's video is for mamas. Now, if you watch on my in my on my videos or check out my videos, you will see videos that I made on a, a baby cream, baby lotion, on a, that I use the coconut milk. Now I am been freaking, I'm loving, loving coconut milk recently, and for this weather that we are in. Coconut milk is so filled with moisture, so I'm reasoning, finding out other means that I can use coconut milk to, on my children's skin. In fact, even on my own skin, in fact, really my husband is using their cream right now. <laughs> okay, so what I did, eh? you know, we live in the, in the cold area, we live in Europe, and then we have... This period is this winter period, okay? So you don't expect to take, to shower your children morning and night. Now, what happens is that when I shower my children probably in the morning, what I do is I use this very mixture on their skin in the evening. Or if I shower them in the evening, in the, in the morning, before they go to school, instead of, you know, showering them again in the morning and it's cold after all, they didn't play, they didn't dirty themselves, I use this very uh, mixture that I'm going to show you guys today on their body to moist their skin. When I moist, moist their skin, and then I'll also, I'll then apply their lotions. And this look this very concussion if i should use that word this very recipe today is quite great because it contains great uh properties coconut uh water and other uh, uh other uh, ingredients i'm going to add in and it's more it makes my children's skin to in fact you know mo it moisturizes my children's skin it lets my children's skin glow i can see the result on it and i can see the way people are admiring my children's skin oh my god i am so grateful that i was able to come up with this recipe and i said you know what i'm going to share this to people to mothers out there and not only mothers in europe also mothers in africa can you know carry up this every recipe and practice it it's quite great on your children's skin now without wasting much time let us go further with this recipe now what i have here is my coconut normal coconut I blended it downstairs, you know, cut, cut it and then blended the coconut. So what I will do is that, what I want to do is that I want to, uh, you know, filter this coconut, the juice, okay? Separate the coconuts um, from the, uh, the shaft and, uh, you know, get extract the milk of the coconuts that I blended. This is just pure coconut and also the coconut water I added it in and then I added a little water, you understand? I added some water of course into this. So I'll extract the, the milk and then uh, we'll continue. So guys, now I have finished my coconut, uh, preparing my coconut milk. If you guys have seen me, guys over there, you guys seen me? Okay, now I've uh, made my coconut milk, okay? The next thing I'm going to add is my, now this is a rose water, this is rose water, okay? Now this rose water, you might decide to add rose water into your mixture if you feel, or you, maybe you have more than two children, I have just two children, and um, this one, if it finishes, I can prepare another one. But let's assume you have more children and you want something that can last for like a week for you. You can decide to add rose water oil, you know, as much as you want, depending on the quality quantity you want. But I can also decide to add rose water oil because rose water is also very great um, on the children's skin. You know, also on adult skin, it is also very, very great for your face. It, it helps to clear uh, uh, pimples, acne. You can use it as a face tuner. You can use it to clear to cleanse your face. Now, I have applied. Um, I've added. Um, rose water into this very mixture i love the scent of my rose water and i love the way it feels on the skin now the next thing i'm going to add is um sorry guys I, this is rose water 
rose water that I added, okay? Now, the next ingredient I'm going to add is my glycerin. That is my glycerin, my vegetable glycerin. I will add it because glycerin is also so very beautiful on moisturizing. It moisturizes the skin so smoothly. Your children's skin, your body feels very smooth. Moisturizer is a great moisturizer, glycerin. So I'm also going to add my glycerin onto this very mixture. I will add like a... Oh, oh, oh I didn't know that... Um, I thought it had uh, the, the cover in it. So, but however, I added one spoon. Though even though it's more than one spoon, it's still not so bad. Okay, this is my glycerin. I added glycerin uh, into this moisture, into this mixture. I'll stir it properly to make sure everything is mixed. Then I'm going to also add my vitamin E oil. Now, this vitamin E oil, this is my vitamin E oil. Sorry, guys, I'm also showing my my other broadcast, so that's why it looks I'm distracted from the from the video. Okay, this is vitamin E oil. So this vitamin E oil, you guys also know, it's also a great moisturizer. Now, vitamin E oil is also going to be serving as a preservative to this very product. Okay, it's going to be serving as a preservative to this very uh, product. Now. I will add my vitamin E to this um, recipe. Okay, so it's it, you can you can decide to be keeping this in your fridge because I'm not going to add any preservative. I have preservative, but I don't feel like adding preservative because I'm not going to use this uh, product for more than one week. Okay, this is not going to stay for more than one week. So rather, instead of me adding preservative. Each at every whenever I finish um, um, using it, I go and keep it back in the freezer. Sorry, in the fridge, not in the freezer. Okay. So for this mixture, I'm going to also add um, quite I will say 10 ml, 10, 10 ml of uh, vitamin E. Now remember, coconut oil also is also rich in vitamin E, vitamin C, vitamin K. So much rich with a lot of vitamins. So I am going to mix this, mix it. Uh, properly now there's another product I'm going to add another um, item that I'm going to add this is yoyoba oh no I'm not going to add yoyoba oil I want to add my um, rose hip oil I'm coming I brought the wrong item so i'm going to add rose hip oil here we call it rosin bottle oil only so it's rose hip oil now what does rose hip oil does rose hip oil is quite very great now for people that have a uh, acne spots and all that even stretch mark rose hip oil helps to clear the stretch marks this is rose hip oil rose hip oil you can rub rose hip oil on your stomach where you have stretch mark and um on your as black spots on your face on your body rosy oil helps to clear uh, dark spots now why do i want to add it on my children's skin because it's rich it's rich with in moisturizing okay and the reason why i also want to add it is because my daughter during the summer time you know the, it's very warm and i always leave the window open so she got uh, some mosquito bites all over her body and the thing is that my daughter was crushing so much this mosquito bites that it gave her some scars you know so i have been using a rose hip oil to clear this mark on my daughter's skin so i normally now since then i always add rose hip oil in every of the recipe i'm preparing for my children their cream their their, their lotion their uh, uh, shower gel anything i'm preparing that she will use i add rose hip oil but however rose hip oil is also good for the whole family every you guys can every Everybody can use it so it does not mean that because babies everybody can use rose hip oil so I am going to also add my rose hip oil onto oh. so now the color is like this you see how it is so I will mix this ingredient and mix it and mix it so I'll mix this ingredient so Decide to you can use decide to use your hand blender to blend this mixture, you know, to blend it just for it to mix. But however, it will still it will not settle. It will not, it cannot mix. It cannot blend like it mixing. You know, overall, you know. So I will just mix it this way. 
if i want i will use my hand blender to just um you know touch it but to avoid noise i don't need to do that okay this is how i prepare my children's body sh body moist now this very um rose um sorry coconut uh, 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 milk that i prepared there's another way you can use you can get your own coconut um coconut milk if you don't want to make if you don't want this other process of using the fresh the fresh coconut you can actually get yourself the coconut shaft when you get yourself the coconut shaft you soak it with um you so you can soak it with this still water make sure you soak it with this still water a little bit of this still water i have this still water here i also use that or you also then or then you add your rose uh, your rose wa your rose water okay you add your rose water or you, yeah you, just, you might decide to add only rose water into it there's another way i also do this i can also add my hibiscus flower in it you know there's different ways there's different 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 ways and somebody wants to ask me something or something let me see do you want me to call you who is that you understand there's different ways you can prepare this but at the end of the day the results you're going to get on your baby's skin your own skin even your own skin because you know most times you don't feel like showering you know if you don't feel like if you don't shower if you have showered in the morning or if you shower in the night okay you want to go out hello okay sorry it was a mistake and you want to go out okay sometimes you want to apply cream on your body your body will be dry what would you do you just need to sprinkle yourself with this kind of this uh, 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 moisture this moisturizing water sprinkle sprinkle it on your body let it dry for like you know after let it dry a little bit in your skin or even just as you sprinkle it you just apply your normal lotion because after all your skin doesn't have to be very dry before you apply your normal uh, body water you understand your, your body lotion sorry so why not so everybody can use this is quite nice you will love and enjoy how it feels on your skin and however you might decide if you're like me that I'm loaded with a lot of oil I can decide to experiment um, my speaker is off are you serious how can my speaker be off okay I can decide I can decide to add different types of oil, uh, oil into this very mixture. I can decide to add any type of oil that I want into this mixture. And then why not? Okay, so this is it. This is it. This little recipe, it doesn't come by easily for people to share their their own um, um, a, a great recipe like this. So you can decide to make, make your own, you know, experiment on your own things. Experiment, ask questions, make goggles. If you follow up some particular training, it will open your eyes into learning a lot of things, even on your own. So this oil has been doing it for me, and this water has been doing it for me, and I'm loving the outcome of my children's skin. So why not? I said, okay, let me share it with my friends, and, you know, give somebody some tips on what to do on their baby's skin. So thank you. And then the next thing I, I will just... Um, add it on my in my oh, i'll add it in my liquid in my container so i'll just add it in this container if anybody have any question please feel free to set, leave it on the comment section i will get back you see wow it makes better sense it entered everything entered in this uh, container so guys here i will leave it and then i'll cover it after each use i'll just i like to know more i like to i would like to, i would like to more information from you I, you would like to let, get more information from me no problem my brother send me a message i can train anybody that that is open for training so guys this is it I will use this on my children's skin and then I put it in the freezer. Uh, sorry, in the fridge, not in the freezer. I put it in the fridge for whenever I want to use it, okay? So thank you very much um, for joining me. Um, for my friends, so if you've not subscribed to my channel, guys, please, I beg you, please do subscribe to this channel, okay? You will really enjoy and learn a lot of things that I'm going to be sharing. I promise you that, but sometimes you have to bear with me because of time, you know, I don't come on for often, but I promise anytime I, I want to come on, it will be something useful. Thank you very much. If you love this, I know that you're going to try it out. Try it out and tell me what you feel. Thank you very much. Bye. Please subscribe and stay tuned.
for the next video. Bye-bye. Do. Ciao, ciao.